In today's Minecraft video, Melon and I are having a super secret base build battle. My base is going to be so secret, even I won't be able to find it. My base is going to be so top secret, you could even call it illegal. What was that, Sonny? Um, nothing. Goats, press that like and subscribe button so Melon doesn't notice me placing this super duper illegal secret bed door. Okay, Melon, today's finally the day. It's a build battle, one versus one, but I've wagered over 100 bitcoins. Bitcoins, bro. What the heck is even that? Okay, I'm just capping anyways. Bro, do you know how much money 100 bitcoins is? Yeah, that's like at least probably like four Robux. Yeah, so why don't we wager 100,000 Robux and a watermelon smoothie? Um, cut out the watermelon smoothie. Okay, sounds good. Game's on. No! All right, fine. I've got to win this and save my fellow watermelon. Speaking of which, for my first secret base, I'm going to be constructing the watermelon base. Just need some lime concrete and some green concrete. Okie dokie, goats. Here's the thing with this build battle. I'm going to create a secret treasure room inside of all my builds. But the chances of Melon finding it is next to zero. Because I'm going to hide it using secret doors. Look at them. They're so perfect. And I think for my first secret door build, I'm going to use the treasure tree door. And what I'm gonna need to do to disguise that is grab some oak saplings and some bone meal. Yes, this is gonna be absolutely ingenious. And I'll place my trees down on the sides like so. Let them grow. Oh, yeah. And let's put some over here. Some over here. And it's time to start building. Beautiful watermelon base. It's gonna be awesome. Alright, that looks pretty good for the front. Now I gotta start constructing the side. And now let's work on the actual house before I place down the secret tree door. I'm gonna need some oak planks, oak logs, cobblestone, and some stone stairs. Yep, this is gonna be a pretty little house. Yeah, something like this. Neat and tidy. Put the stairs down on the edge, and I think I'll need some full stone bricks and some slabs too, actually. Make sure they're not infested, though. Oh, that's that's perfect. Keep on building up and a slab on top. Now we just got to fill this in with some planks. Nice. That's one side of the house. Now I've just got to build it all the way across. That way I've got lots of room to place my beds, chests, and more. Put the cobblestone along the bottom because it looks nice. And then we place down our logs. Oh yeah, this build is going to be perfect. And just like that, the watermelon has been completed. Except you might be wondering why I left a hole right here. Well, it's for my secret door. Oh, sorry. Secret door. Oh, yeah. This is the entrance inside the watermelon. And I'll put the prize right here. Psych, this isn't the prize. This is just gonna be a trap. Give me some ghost blocks. And I'll fill the bottom right here with some lava. Perfect. Now when Sonny goes for his prize, he'll die a terrible death. Because this is just a fake entrance. The real entrance will be right here. You'll have to use the secret climber to climb up and then hop down in here where the actual prize room will be. And now you might be wondering, where's the door to this house? And the answer is, there is none. This is going to act as the perfect distraction so Melon can't find the hidden treasure. And now let's actually set up the hidden treasure, shall we? I'll put one more tree right over here. Excellent. And then when I I press this little button. Oh, wait. I forgot. There's many buttons. Oh, I gotta act faster. It's like this, that, this, that. Come on, open up. Open up. Real prize room. This is so stressful. Just open. Ah, there we go. Secure house unlocked. Now I just gotta dig this out a bit and create a little treasure room. And when he reaches his prize room, he'll receive one golden nugget. Seems pretty fair to me. And now now my first top secret most secure base has been completed. Check it out. Watermelons. His favorite. <laughs> and I'll also put a melon juice there. A melon juice there. Oh, he's gonna lose it when he sees these. Climb back out of the secret tree and watch it close itself up. <gasps> I gotta remove this chest though. I don't want him to find it. Let it burn. Burn. 
Okay, I think I'm ready. Time's up, brother! I'm coming to your build! Isn't she beautiful, Sonny? Check it out! It's the melon! Melon. Yeah, cool. You built a little melon hut. And let me guess, secret entrance right here? Uh, no, no. Sonny, you have to go in survival! Go in survival! Why? Why would I go in survival? It's part of the game! My arrows! Okay, fine, I'm in survival! Now what? I just go open the door and... Oh, oh no, I'm dead! Ah! Uh. <laughs> that's why you had to be in survival. You think that's funny, huh? Let me show you something funny. Look what I'm holding. Die! No! Sonny, you're not allowed to do that! Get in there! Burn! No! Nah, bro. This first round of the build battle was too easy! Oh, you're lucky you're in creative. Bro, what are you talking about? You're not even done. You fell for my trap. Oh, wait. What am I supposed to do? I thought that was it. You're supposed to find my prize room, and you haven't even made it there yet. Dang. Dang it. Secret prize room. One of these has got to be another door. Another contraption of some form or sort. Yes. What if I need to climb up? Uh, no. Sonny, you can't just be placing builds. Well, there was no way up there. Bro, you got to figure it out the right way. Plus, you're running out of time. You only have two minutes left. Okay. It's got to do with this place. Oh, there's a secret tunnel. No, Sonny, what are you talking about secret tunnel? Like there, there's a hole in the wall. Oh, that's not supposed to be there. Hold on. My bad, my bad. Oh my goodness. How am I supposed to get up? Are one of these climber blocks? Bruh. Gotta literally rub my head into all of this watermelon. Bruh. Bruh. No! Let's go! And then down the center, I bet. And I'm in! Real prize room! Let's go! One golden nugget for the goat. <sighs> Fine, I'll admit it. You actually got into my base. But not as fast as I'm gonna get into your base! Okay, we'll see about that one, Melon. Alright. It seems like I have found a house. But there's literally no doors on this thing. What the heck? What is this? It's all part of the plan. You have three minutes to locate my prize room. Good luck. Uh, okay. It's uh, gotta be... There's gotta be some ghost blocks somewhere. Something I'm missing... Let me tell you, Melon, you are gonna love the prize room. Dude, what the heck? How are you supposed to get in here? It's gotta have to do with these weird blocks. They make no sense just staying in here. Actually, no, I just placed these at the last second because I thought they'd look cool. Dang it, bro. How am I supposed to get in there? Do you want some help? I could give you goggles of true vision. Oh, that would actually be very helpful. I wouldn't mind. There you go. Take a look around. Inspect it thoroughly. Um, okay. Let's see any ghost blocks that I missed. Bro, there's like Literally no ghost blocks. <laughs> You thought I would help you? Yeah, right, bro. I'm winning this build battle. I uh, you know there's gotta be something on the roof. Come on, there's gotta be something here. Does there really need to be something? There's gotta be some kind of entrance that's part of the rules. There is a secret entrance. I won't cap. I won't cap. I know that, Sonny. But how am I possibly supposed to get in there? Whoever said the house is what holds the treasure? What else is there, Sonny? What, like a tree or something? Yeah, totally a tree. <laughs> That'd be weird. Oh, I'm so confused. Maybe it's just underground somewhere. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You can't be breaking blocks like that. What do you mean? Why not? Ah! Get out of there. Bro, there's nowhere else to go. Melon, you have one minute left and you're dead. One minute to find the secret base. Maybe I just bust on in this house. Yeah, do it. You should totally do that. Put a TNT or something. You want some help? Bro, there's literally nothing in there. But you were super scared about me digging over here. There's gotta be something I'm not seeing. Melon, no breaking blocks. Fine, but Sonny, please give me a hint. I'm so confused. Look to the trees. I am Groot. Bro, what does that even mean? It's gotta be below one of the trees. Okay, but I don't see any ghost blocks on any of these trees. Wait a second. Why is there a button right here? 30 seconds left. Time's ticking. Wait, if I click this button. What's that sound? And what just happened? Now there's another button here. Tick tock, tick tock. I'm so confused. What is going on? It's not even doing anything. You're running out of time. Wait, there's another button here. Dude, <gasps> maybe it's like a timer. Yes, it's my secret secure base. Good luck getting in. Come on. How many more buttons do I have to do? How many more are there? 10 seconds left. Time's ticking. You're gonna lose. 
Wait, what's happening? Did I do something? Yo, I think I found your secret base. Oh, no. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Watermelons, this has got to be the treasure room. Dang it, you found the hidden treasure. Congratulations. But wait, why is there a watermelon smoothie? No, no. <laughs> Who's the real winner now? Well, Melon, I would say round one was a success. Sonny, whatever you do, do not drink that watermelon smoothie. Okay, I won't drink it. Instead, I'll throw it in lava. No! Why? Because I thought it'd be funny to see your reaction. Anyways, it's time for round two of this build battle. And this time, Sonny, we've got extra time, meaning we're gonna construct the most secure bases ever. That's right. And there's no chance you'll find my hidden treasure. And there's no chance that you'll find my secret treasure. Oh, dang it, he said it first. Okie dokie, it's time for round two. And the theme of this one is gonna be a nice upgraded house, because that's gonna be my theme every single time. I'm just gonna make the house bigger and better. And in order to do that, I'm gonna need some polished granite. Because the best, most expensive homes are full of it. Then I'll also need some quartz. There we go, smooth quartz. And I'm gonna need some concrete to construct this. And what else do I want? You know what, let's just start with that. And we'll lay the foundations now. Get a good building block to work with. And done. Next up, we need to lay down the framework. So so, yeah, let's make it like this. This will look cool. Modern archways. Very nice. Then I shall layer it with this concrete and have a peak of the house even taller. Okay, this is going to take a while. I'll be right back. All right, goats, it's time to begin my build. And I've got the perfect idea. Step one, create a diversion. I will create a bunch of small holes in the ground to waste Sonny's time. He'll be so confused and he'll totally think that the secret base lies in one of these holes. But really, it'll have nothing to do with the secret base. Just gotta make some holes in the ground. So Sonny can look in the holes and find nothing. Okay, so as you could see, I've begun to lay the full framework. Let's take a look at what we're cooking up. So that's the front of the house. Now I've just got to extend all of these walls backwards, duplicate them on the other side, and it'll be pretty much ready. And now it's time to construct my real base. And for this, I'm gonna think outside of the box a little bit. Or should I say outside of the circle? Because I'm gonna build my base right on the edge. Let's make it right about here. And it's time to dig out my base. All that's left to do now is a couple finishing touches. Yes, we'll add some fancy rose bushes so that we have a premium house. Only the finest plant pots around here. Excellent. That is is looking good. Now we're talking. But you're probably wondering, Sonny, where are you gonna put your secret base so the melon can't find it? And how are you possibly gonna construct it? I'll show you. I've got this right here. A bed. And what I'm gonna also do is grab regular beds. And a lot of them. Then I am gonna take my regular beds and go like this. I don't even care. Put them everywhere. Double deckers. Triple deckers. Spam them. Yes. This this is to throw Melon off of the scent. I will place these everywhere, as far as the eye could see. Farther than the elephant graveyard in Lion King. No one will even know where these beds go. And the hole has been dug, but I want to decorate my base a little bit. Yep, that's pretty good. Yep, yep, yep. There we go. That'll do the trick. Then I'm going to go upstairs. And here I shall place a singular bed in the upper left corner. And watch what happens when I open it. It leads to a secret bunker. But I need to make a treasure room in here, so let's carve it out a little bit. Go a little deeper. And yeah, that looks pretty good. And once more, I shall grab the schmelins. Yes, he will enjoy this quite delightfully. Only this time, I'll put a melon popsicle. Yes. Yes, inside of a refrigerator. Oh, it's gonna be glorious. I'll say, open up the refrigerator, why don't you? And bang, popsicles. All right, let's just put the ladder in now. Yep, that's pretty good. Come on up. Close up the secret base. And and let's put a lot of regular beds in here, too. Gotta keep it blended in nicely. There we go. Now there's nothing to see here. Nothing at all. And boom. The base has been completed. And let me add Sonny's prize in here. One golden ingot. But there's no way he's gonna find my base. All right, shut it down! Thumbs up.
That's perfect, because I'm finished, and there's no way you'll find my secret hidden treasure room. All right, challenge accepted, Sonny. It's gonna be easy, dude. There's a front door. Yeah, a front door that leads into the house. What is this? Why is it filled with red beds? The world may never know, Melon. Can't even sleep in any of these, Sonny. What is this? Don't worry, I'll make it nighttime for you. Bro, there's nothing even up here. Melon, good luck figuring it out. Out. I don't understand. Okay, it's gotta have something to do with these red beds though, right? Surely, surely. Hold on, Melon, this one looks comfy. Hey, I was gonna sleep there. Fine, I'll sleep here. Well, it blocks off this room, Sonny, and I need to get in here. Something's gotta be up with one of these red beds. I'm so freaking confused. Maybe it has nothing to do with this house at all. You know what? That would have actually been really clever if I built all this with all the beds to make it really weird and confusing, but then it was just a trap door in the backyard. Oh, wait. Are you trying to play with me right now? Is it a trap door in the backyard? Nah, bro. It's got something to do with the beds. I'm not that clever. One of these beds has got to not be like the others. Maybe this one. This one is like the w oh, weirdest place to run. No, don't touch it. Don't touch. That's my bed. I want that bed, though. Dang it. It's just a normal bed. Yeah, bro. Good luck figuring this one out. Dude, I don't understand. All of these beds are the exact same. I'll let you ask one question. Uh, okay. Which room is this, uh, sus bed located? Upstairs. What the heck? That actually helps a lot, though. Dude, these beds gotta get out of the way. It's so annoying. Bro, stop breaking my beds. Ugh, dude. Is it this floating bed? I don't think beds can normally float. It's gotta be that one. <laughs> Bro, you could always stack up beds. Dude, I don't understand. I can't even get back there. You gotta move carefully. You must traverse the world of the beds. Uh, Sunny? There's something up with this bed right here. I don't see anything wrong with it. It's probably because it's missing its double bunk bed. Here, hold on. Let me fix that. Move, Melon, move, move, move. Let me, uh, there you go. Uh, I don't know about that, Sonny. It is the only bed that has a different floor beneath it. Yeah, there's nothing sus about that. What would happen if I were to... Whoa! What is this? I've done it. I found the prize room. It's filled with melons and melon popsicles. What is this? <laughs> That's right, bro. Eat it. Eat it. No. You'll rue the day you've done this to me, Sonny. That's what you think. Instead, I'm gonna head over to your house or base or whatever you built. What? What did you even build? There's just holes in the ground. I built something beautiful, utterly magnificent. Dude, it's it's nothing. It's just holes in the ground. Hold on, let me let me check these holes, Melon. Uh, no, Sonny, you can't do that. You're gonna have to go in survival. I'm just checking these groundhog holes. There's gotta be something in one of them. Hey, yo! Stop cheating. Just play legit for once in your life. Life. I always play legit. I'm just very confused as to why there's a million holes in the ground. Where's your build? Uh, <laughs> I don't know, Sonny. You're gonna have to figure that out. Bro, is it in one of these holes? Are you kidding me? This is gonna be so boring. Oh, this one's got dirt. Sonny, you only got four minutes to find it. Uh, what is wrong with you? A few minutes later. Bro, what is the deal with these holes in the ground? There's no secret trap doors. None of these lead anywhere. It's not ghost block. Why did you do this? Because, Sonny, it's a perfect distraction. And why are you standing so far away? Uh, you only got 30 seconds left, Sonny. Good luck. Why are there trap doors on the edge? And this looks like glass. No way. You made an underground house? You weren't supposed to find this. Bro, this is actually cool. Look at this chair. It looks so comfortable. I can't believe you found my base at the last second. And one golden ingot. It's all mine. Bro, that was actually really awesome. Nice house. <sighs> well, Sonny, I guess you found my base. But you won't be able to find my prize room next time. Yeah, that's what you think, bro. If you just stare at your prize room, I'm gonna find it. Okay, I've learned from my mistakes. It's time for round three. And there's less than a 0% chance you find my base. Oh, Sonny, I'll find your base. Then the prize room. And there better not be any kind of watermelon food. <laughs> no problem.
promises. Ow. Whoops. And now it's time to begin the ultimate melon most secure base. Okay, for my third build, I want to do a castle. A nice classic stone castle. So let's grab cobblestone, a little bit of regular stone, and even some stone bricks. And then I need to build it like this. It is going to be a process, let me tell you. Okay, goats, I've had enough of Sonny and his shenanigans. He's clearly using some kind of cheat. I can't find any secret doors here, except the basic, you know, ghost block ones. He's gotta be up to something. And I know just the person to call. Yo, Quandale, Sonny's using some kind of secret doors to cheat. I know what he is using, take this. Whoa, what the heck is this? An iron magic doorknob. Five minutes later. <sighs> Finally, placing all those stone blocks was pretty boring, so I just wanted to skip that part. Now, let's get on to the fun stuff. Look at my inventory. I have a giant decoy door, and I'm gonna place it right in here. Oh, yes. Melon's gonna think this is the place he needs to traverse to. He's gonna open it up. Whoa, that is so cool. Well, first things first, before I deploy this iron magic doorknob, I need to construct a base. Let's use some netherite and stone. And build this base. It will be an impenetrable fortress. And once he waits 10 years for this to finish opening, he'll go on in. He'll see this chest and he'll assume that he found my secret treasure room. But in reality, all there is is one nether star, which I actually do need to take a copy of it, so I'll grab one. Check it out, goats. The base has been complete. And now all that I need to do, go right about here. When you place this thing down, boom! It builds a magic doorway all the way to the center. Here is where the prize room will remain. The only way to access it is if you have one of these things. Otherwise, it's impossible. Check it out. When I close this door, the pathway disappears. It's literally gone. And then he'll be all confused because I'll tell him that's not the treasure. The real treasure is watermelons. And then he'll have to try and figure out where those are. So let me just close this door up and show you where the watermelons will truly be located. It'll be in here behind a second decoy door. Except this one is really confusing. I actually don't know if this is going to work. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna work. I gotta break that. Instead, I will use the heart-shaped door. Hopefully this one works. Whoa, that looks a little bit sus, but let me see how it works when I click it. Actually, how do I open this? I actually don't remember. Drop a stack of TNT to remove. Okay, well, that's not what I want. I want to open it. So, let's grab ourselves some gold blocks and fill this room up. Sonny is gonna love this place, except he's never gonna get to see it. That's what he gets for cheesing me. Oh, no, I busted up my castle, too. Chest filled with golden blocks, but he'll never get to access it. Oh, well. Just like that, the only way into the base is gone. Let's try this again. There we go. There's actually a door this time. And then I'm gonna try and cover it up a bit. Oh, that looks really bad if I try and cover it up. Okay. You know what? No, I'm covering it. It's gonna look bad, but it's all part of the plan. There's gonna be layers to this. Layers like an onion. And then I'll take some regular old-fashioned ghost blocks. Melon will not suspect this because I haven't used any of these yet. And it looks incredibly sus. So it should give him a chance. And I don't know if he could even click the door while he's in the ghost blocks, but that's his problem. Anyway, so once he does get through the door, he'll be in this part of the world. And what does he have to do here? He's got to go all the way through the corridor and see this minecart contraption. And this is where things get crazy. I need to take this minecart door and I need to place it right here. Perfect. Now the only way through is if you're in a minecart while carrying a nether star to open up the secret wall. So now let me place a minecart. Boom. He's gonna have to ride it all the way around, which I should probably give him a booster. There we go. So that should boost him enough into the wall, and then he can open it on up if he figures this out. And then back here behind the secret wall, I shall build the treasure room. Let's go. Check it out. The secret wander. And I'm gonna put it like this. It'll be one glistening melon like this. And right about here, we'll make an old fashioned lava trap. Perfect. <laughs> oh, I can't wait for him to try and rescue his glistening melon. Hey, 
Mellon. There's only 10 seconds left. Are you finished? I'm done, Sonny. Let's go. I want to check out your base first. Okay. Peep it out, Sonny. Good luck entering my indestructible base. Uh, dude, what is this? Oh, yeah, you have to be in survival. No cheating and using creative mode. Bro, this looks like an alien spaceship or like a giant Rubik's cube made of netherite. It's the most indestructible base you've ever seen, Sonny. Yeah, but watch me infiltrate on the first try. Yeah, uh, you're not gonna get into this base, Sonny. <laughs> There's literally no way. Oh, let me guess. You built something off the edge of the world again. Yeah. Come on. Bro, <laughs> this build arena is so huge, but I know you've got something on the edge. Willie checks out the edge. I'm gonna open the door and tease him with it. Bang! Come on. Let me just open that up. <laughs> this way you can look at the prize. Dang it. There's nothing over here. I thought for sure you were doing that trick again. Sonny, Sonny, it's right here, bro. I feel bad. Dude, come over here. Check it out. No way. You have a secret door over here? Yep, totally. Totally. Why'd you close it? Dude, dude open it back up. Bro. <laughs> Good luck getting to my secret door. Let me guess. There's a secret button or something. What the What the heck? How do I do this? Sonny, I don't know what secret door you're talking about, bro. There's literally no secret door there. There was. I saw it. Wait, now there's nothing in this wall? Hold on. Let me go in creative. Come on. There's got to be something. Bro, there's literally nothing here. Get out of creative mode, Sonny. There was nothing in there anyways. Bro, that's not part of the rules. You need to start to chill, bro, and stop cheating everything. Fine. Fine. Let's see here. What should I do? Maybe I got to get to the top of this build. Yep, totally. Just got to get to the top of the build, Sonny. Many, many minutes later. Melon, I've been looking forever. The sun's literally set. It's nighttime. There's no way into this thing. It's an impenetrable fortress. What are you talking? Dude, just go right here. What are you talking about, bro? Wait, what the heck is that? No, Melon, Mel put that back. What are you? I didn't put anything on there, bro. It's just a secret door. No, no, Melon, Melon, I saw you put something, but then it disappeared after you picked an item. You just held it. I don't know what you're talking about, Sonny. <laughs> Besides, once the sun sets, you lose. Give me that item. Give me that item right now. Nope. Stay away from me, Sonny. Stay away. Don't make me go into my hole. You're gonna make me go into my hole. Yeah, right. There's no way you could escape me. Come on. Are you kidding me? Uh, oh, uh, hey, Sonny. How are you doing this? Don't worry about it. Anyways, you have five seconds left. Five, four, three, two, one. Ow! Yeah, at least I can still use commands on you. Well, you still lost, Sonny, and you didn't figure it out. Boom! Bro, your treasure room was in the center of it? Yep, you could have had all those golden blocks, Sonny, but you failed. Melon, how are you doing this? There was nothing in here before when I checked. Ow! What the heck? I'm suffocating. Stop. Help me. Help. Die. No, Melon, please. Melon, please. Sonny? Sonny? No, I didn't mean to actually kill you. Nah, I kind of did. It was pretty funny. Hey, Melon. I'm up on the wall. Get over here. Oh, it feels good to have the most secure base, Sonny. Yeah, whatever. Now you still have to try and find my treasure. Now let's see if you enjoy getting trolled. All right. Easy. All I've got to do is open up this gate and I'll be chilling. Sonny, why is this so easy? Yeah, it's so easy. It's just so easy. Do I need like a key or something? Or can I just open this up? It's actually just opening up. That was easy peasy, dude. Wait, 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 wait. What the heck? There was supposed to be a secret password. Uh, Sonny, I, I think I'm just gonna enter your base. Are you kidding me right now? Hey, wait a second. What? This isn't a prize room. There's only a nether star in here. <laughs> That's right. The nether star is simply a key that you will require later on if you find my hidden treasure. Uh, well, it looks like there was some door over here. Wait, what? What are you talking about? Like, right here, I can see a door. So, I'm pretty sure all I've got to do is use this and enter. Melon, you can't keep using that thing! Uh, did I make it, bro? There's nothing back here. I'm so confused. Wait, I found a minecart! No way. There's no way you're getting through already. Not like this. My plan, it's backfiring on me. Bro, but this literally doesn't lead anywhere. I don't understand, Sonny. What am I supposed to do on this minecart? You're right. It doesn't lead anywhere. You're totally right. I am so confused, Sonny. And what was the point of this nether star? 
<sighs> nothing, nothing. Put it away. Wait, what? What just happened? What is this place? I found it. The legend. Ow! No, not the glistening melon. No! That's what you get. You deserve it. And now let me show you guys how to enter the secret room properly. You just hold another star while in a mine cart. Open sesame and... Hop out. Oh, I was too quick. Dang it. You gotta do that again. Anyways, did you get your glistening watermelon? No, I didn't, Sonny. Why would you troll me like that? Troll you like what? I thought you made it to the treasure room. Bro, I can't even get back there. How did you do that? You need to be in a mine cart holding a nether star and then it should open up. That's so oddly specific. I don't even get it. Let me in there. It's not working, Sonny. I'm just dying. Yeah. Well, you glitched through at least. And now I shall claim my glistening melon, but actually. <laughs> yeah! Now don't slip and fall. I won't, Sonny. Dang it. I wanted to watch you burn. And I want to watch all you goats. Press that like and subscribe button. Do it now. And comment down below who you think won this build battle. I'm pretty sure my secret doors were way more epic. I don't know about that, Sonny. 